Hello! Look how beautiful it is today. And the crows are louder than I am. <laughs> Welcome to December. The parrots deck the vlogs. Okay, I passed by this little patch on my way out pretty much every day. And only now have I noticed that they're full of these plants, which are perfect for practicing how to violate boundaries. The touch-me-nots. Look at this. Oh man! Okay, that was a really bad example. Uh, let me try with these tender leaves. Let's see if they work. There we go. Did you see how that worked? Hmm, let's close a few more of them. I, I mean, I don't know if this is like me harming the plant. I really hope it isn't. But I want to see. This is so fun. I don't know why it's so fun. It's so cool. You can like just do one side and then do the other side and then do half the leaf. There's so many of them here. And they've got all these like light purple fuzzies. Fuzzy fuzzy stuff. And there's so many of them. Wow. You know, I was probably a child the last time these plants were around me. Okay. I'm gonna stop bothering the plants and go to eat now. And there's so many. I could probably spend a lot of time here just doing that. Um, okay, back to the road. Look at how cute this fallen leaf is. And look, hearts everywhere. Heart-shaped leaves. And the sun is beating down hard on these baby vegetables. Um, aubergines, brinjal, bangan, eggplant, whatever you want to call them. Um, I saw these and took a film of them, oh, filmed them uh, a little while back, maybe a week ago or so. So I'm going to put that footage in right now so you can see how much they've grown in a short time. I am back at the very first restaurant I ever tried here on the cliff. It's called Seaview Lounge. We have a nice map of Varkala here. You may pause if you like. But anyway. I feel really lucky to have come to this restaurant again today and at a really good time. Not only was the food really good and a hearty portion, but I happened to be sat next to some really lovely people. A group of friends was celebrating a birthday, which is going to happen later on in the month, I later realized. Um, but they were celebrating it right now and they actually shared birthday cake with me. I got a few pictures with the group of friends and it felt really good to have that little human interaction, even though I didn't crush their party or join in. Um, or have any deep conversation with them. I will leave their Instagram handles in the description below once I get all their permissions to share that information. But the pictures that you can see of us together are in this video with their consent. Their generous sharing of love really made me beam and totally made my day. Chocolate cake, that's your birthday cake, and so many pretty smiles and great vibes. Um, I myself had ordered one of the restaurant's specials, which was a uh, creamy veg curry in a very kind of um, mildly flavored gravy with perfectly cooked rice, and it was wonderful to have along with some exquisite chocolate cake. So I'm going to read the second chapter of The Great Gatsby. I finished the first one yesterday at the Little Tibet restaurant, and I have I think one and a half hours here before I should head back and take a shower and begin work. Um, so that's that. 
Okay, so if you excuse the neighbor who's also speaking, this is kind of like my room and my setup. I mean, I will eventually share the video of where I'm staying, but not while I'm staying here. So as you can see, I brought my own little table and usually I work here, but I just got myself a proper, proper table. I'm so grateful for this. I can't believe I've done an entire month of work, um, including editing videos and stuff like just with this. And these beds are like super squishy, so it's like really messed my back up big time. And now I can actually have a neat and clean bed. Woohoo! Um, bye, working on this table. And I'll like draw those curtains. Right now I want some privacy, but yeah. There's a nice view actually from there. But yeah, I'm like drying stuff on the window, and I don't want to show that. Yeah. Happy days, happy days. I haven't really cared much about Instagram and I have not really posted anything in a very long time there, but since meeting these wonderful people for lunch um, and we exchanged Insta details, I was like, oh, maybe I should, I should, you know, uh, get my act together and maybe post some stuff. So it does seem like I'm a legit YouTuber, even though I probably am not. And I got um, one of my friends actually shared this and i was just like oh my gosh this is me this person here this is me a little bit more dark skinned but this is me right there that's me me i got out of bed today me how have i not liked this yet steps are really steep. I decided to go to the beach in between my work bits, and I was wondering whether to go out for dinner or stay in. I knew I was tired, and I had to edit this video. And I had already spent money on lunch, so I made the sensible decision to stay at the place I call home these days for dinner. You can see pictures of the delicious meal I had on the screen right now. I am feeling really, really grateful for the privileges I have and I feel very proud of the courage it has taken me to live in this moment, to spend time in this place, to go about the small adventures I do. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I hope I can keep up the momentum and share more of this beautiful life I am living with you, even when it isn't as beautiful as this day has been. As I haven't introduced myself in this video yet, <laughs> I'm a leaf. I look forward to reading your comments and I would love it if you subscribed as well. Take good care of yourself and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.